Stonework of the Gods, the incredible ancient city of Totiwikin. An aerial view of Totiwikin. Featured. Totiwikin, aka birthplace of the gods, is an ancient city where according to the Aztecs the gods created the universe. The early history of this ancient city is filled with enigmas, and its origin and founders are unknown to history. The ancient Totawakanos did not leave behind any written records, and we have no way of knowing who founded the city, what caused its decline or even what the real name of the place was. We do know that Totawakan was one of the largest pre-Columbian cities in the Americas with an estimated population of around 200,000 people during its peak, meaning that it was among five of the largest cities in the world during its epoch. Archaeological evidence points towards the fact that Totawakan was a multi-ethnic city, with distinct quarters occupied by Otomi, Zipotec, Mixtec, Maya, and Nahua people. The power of Totawakan was felt nearly all Mesoamerican roots, as show the discoveries in cities like Tyclan Monte Alban, among other places that had an important relation with the Totawakanos. While researchers today call the city Totawakan, it was not the original name of the ancient city. This ancient city was named Temti plus Huacan by Nahuatl speaking Aztec centuries after the fall of the city sometime around 550 AD. In fact, almost 1000 years before the Aztecs, Totawakan was the largest urban center of Mesoamerica. The only existing reference to Totawakan before it was named by Nahuatl speaking as Tex is believed to have been found in hieroglyphic texts from the Maya region as Bu, or Place of Reeds. This term Totawakan has been translated to either birthplace of the gods, or place where gods were born. This translation accurately reflects the Nahuatl creation myths which are said to have occurred precisely at Totawakan. Interestingly, Totawakan is the place where the Aztecs believed the gods created the universe. Supermassive structure, astronomically aligned. Just as many other pyramids around the globe, those found at Totawakan are beyond fascinating. One of the most notorious characteristics about the pyramids and monuments found at Totawakan's Avenue of the Dead is the fact that they seem to align in a perfect distance from each other, as if the builders created the structures copying the orbits of our planets in our solar system. Many will find it an extraordinary details that the giant pyramid of the Sun is positioned at the center of the other structures just as the Sun is at the center of our solar system and that the planets revolve around it. Our solar system has officially nine planets, and curiously, the structure of Totawakan are nine. Interestingly, the Pyramid of the Sun is the largest building in Totawakan, coincidence? And the second in all of Mesoamerica, just behind the Great Pyramid of Colula. Due to its size, the pyramid can be seen several kilometers away. It has a height of 63 meters with approximately 225 meters per side, reason why it is usually compared to the Pyramid of Cheops in Giza. The Pyramid of the Sun at Totawakan consists of five superimposed frustaconical bodies and a three-body structure. The Pyramid of the Sun is located on the eastern side of the Avenue of the Dead, practically aligned perpendicular to this road. Interestingly, the Pyramid of the Sun isn't the oldest structure in the city. The Pyramid of the Moon is believed to be the oldest standing monument in Totawakan. Interestingly, George Calgill, an archaeologist at Arizona State University believes that the site's visible surface remains have all been mapped in detail. But only 5% has been scientifically excavated. So. Who built this mind-bending, supermassive city? Why was it abandoned? 
Why did it exist in the first place? Who lived there 1000 years before the Aztecs? What was its original name? And why is it so fascinatingly mysterious? Anyone?